Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial and today it's on item cases. So this plugin is based on um, a system where you can open a case, let's have a look at this test case, and it will flick through all the items inside, it will slow down eventually and just pick one at random. So it's similar to CSGO cases um, in that regard. So you can create new cases, you can edit what's inside, the chance of getting a various item, and it's really, really cool. So let me go ahead and um, delete some of these. And we've also got the golden apple case. So um, as you know, there's two types of golden apples. One is extremely powerful and one is sort of medium. So I've filled this with lots of medium ones, and are we going to get it? Oh, so close to the really powerful one. Um, there was a very low chance of getting the powerful one obviously we didn't get it um, so yeah this is really cool um, your players can get it via a command and you can set it up so they can't do it every second um, so let's go ahead and look at the commands now so what I'm talking about now is the redeem command so um, if we've waited enough time since we redeemed it last time um, we must wait one more minute so uh, let's have a look at another case which is the god apple case um, and that is not redeemable so how do you make a case redeemable well you do case set redeem delay the case name which is g apple and then how many minutes so um, depending on your server if it's survival or factions you might want to set it to 3600 what's that uh, is that how many minutes in a day? No, I can't remember. That might be seconds in a day or something. Um, but yeah, uh, maybe three minutes. So uh, we could redeem it and it will give it to us. So I've actually got an extra one now. Uh, we could use it and if we try to redeem it again, obviously we, we can't because we've already used it. So it stops people uh, getting a lot of stuff, which is great. Now let's go ahead and create our own one. And we're gonna call it Creeper, like that. Now, it doesn't have anything inside at the moment, so let's go ahead and edit Creeper. Um, here we go. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna fill it with lots and lots of Creeper heads. We're gonna remove some of them, uh, like that, at random, um, and fill the rest of the holes with TNT. Just to make it interesting, because uh, people don't really want Creeper heads, do they? And then you can just hit Escape, and that saves it. And you can do Case, Give, your username and creeper and here we go so if we open it what are we gonna get we will most likely get a creeper head and yeah no surprise there because there was a higher chance of getting it um, so we could try that again and hopefully we might get some TNT this time um, so this would be really fun in any server uh, doing this maybe saving them up and um, doing them with your friends so you can do case list, obviously, to sh show you which cases there are. Maybe there could be donated cases and stuff with more powerful stuff. Um, and obviously you can remove um, any cases you want. So you could do a Christmas, Easter, Panica, uh, Ramadan case um, with different things in. And obviously once that's over, you don't want a Christmas case in the summer, so you can just delete it. So overall, it's a fantastic plugin. It is a premium plugin on Spigot, so make sure you create an account first and then you will have the option to purchase it. Uh, I've got a lot of questions why uh, the download is not available for some plugins. That's because they're premium um, on Spigot. So um, I think that's about it. You can obviously edit lots of things in the config and that's pretty straightforward. Um, so subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.